Welcome back everyone. The transition to electric vehicles is expected to be a multi-trillion dollar mega trend as it unfolds, generating loads of investment opportunities in EV makers, EV charging stations, battery metals and more. We recently called some decent EVs for your watch list and so in this video, I bring you updates on three top EV charging stocks which analysts tipped could give 10 bagger returns. We are bullish on the EV sector and since we recently called on some of these stocks in the market crash, we are already seeing some double digit returns. So you want to make sure you stick around to the end to assess which of these stocks deserves a place on your watch list and let me know in the comment sections below. And so if you are bullish about the EV bull run, please drop a like on the video to spread its reach and if you are new to the channel, please subscribe and hit the bell so you never miss out on any of these gems and also check us out on Twitter for live market updates. And on the back of the market uncertainty, we are beginning to see investors flock into US options trading. And so if you need a decent platform which enables you to trade options and OTC penny stocks, which we mostly cover on the channel and are not tradable on Robinhood or Weibo, you want to consider Interactive Brokers, which is a one-stop shop platform which can take your investment to another level, including investing in OTC penny stocks, cryptos, options and more. It is an award-winning platform with some of the lowest costs in the industry, including some zero commission trades across 135 markets. And so regardless of where you are in the United States, Europe, Asia or Australia, you will be able to open an account with them. And I personally use interactive brokers for my OTC investing and as you can see here, you can get most of the single, double or triple zero penny stocks which we've called on the channel on the IBKR platform. So check it out from the link in the top pinned comment and see for yourself. Thank you so much and with that said, let's get on with it with our first store which is Chargepoint Holdings, ticker number CHPT which is currently bouncing from its recent lows of $12 per share and now sitting up at $16.25 with a market cap of $5.7 billion. Chargepoint is showing some strong recovery at the moment but it's still very much in deep value as over 6 months it is still sitting down 23% and pumping up some stellar results. We've been talking about Chargepoint for a while on the channel as we're very bullish about the EV ecosystem and we feel this is a long-term whole germ. We call this place early in the Discord and so if you want to get in early, enhance your learning and investment opportunities, you should consider joining the private Discord via the link in the description below where you join a group of people still able to make green in their portfolios in this current market uncertainty. And so here's what's new with Chargepoint. Chargepoint reported their fourth quarter and full fiscal year 2022 financial results and they stated that quarterly revenues increased 90% year on year and annual revenues increased 65% year on year, both above the top end of the guidance which is simply fantastic. They said revenues for the fourth quarter was $80.7 million, an increase of 90% from $42.4 million in the prior year and revenues for the full year was $242.3 million an increase of 65% up from $146 million. They have over 174,000 ports which were activated as of January 31st with approximately 51,000 in Europe and they expect annual revenues of between $450 to $500 million for the fiscal year 2023 which is just fantastic. And the CEO Pascal Romano commented that Chargepoint delivered another outstanding quarter exceeding the high end of both their quarterly and annual revenue guidance and advancing their technology leadership in their commercial, fleet and residential verticals across North America and Europe. And they had numerous successes in their first year as a public traded company including a 65% year on year annual revenue increase, two strategic acquisitions, expansion of their activated port count by over 60% and growing their team of world class talent. And for the full fiscal year ending January 31st, 2023 guidance, Chargepoint expects revenues of between $450 to $500 million. And at the midpoint, this represents an anticipated increase of 96% compared to the prior year with a non-GAAP gross margin of between 22 to 26%. And in their recent presentation, they added that Chargepoint's growth is directly proportional to EV penetration at a potential 41% compounded annual growth rate seeing the commercial ports from about 40,000 to 160,000 by 2026, which is just massive. And with that in mind, 
They say they are winning North America, expanding in Europe with over 174,000 activated ports, 11,500 DC ports, and approaching 300,000 ports accessible via roaming integrations, which is just huge. And to sum it up, Chargepoint was named to Fast Company's prestigious annual list of the world's most innovative companies for 2022, ranking third amongst companies in North America. And Fast Company recognized Chargepoint for its leadership in enabling global electrification from passenger vehicles to fleets, with a network of more than 174,000 active charging ports, bringing charging to more people and places than ever before. And this is Chargepoint's second time receiving the recognition from Fast Company, having previously been ranked fifth amongst transportation companies. An analyst commented that Chargepoint's full year revenue guidance of between $450 to $500 million range is far above consensus expectations of $380 million. And so, despite the constrained supply chain environment, the company sees its growth rate accelerating to 96% this year from 65% in the last fiscal year which is all very exciting. And next up to our number two, which is EVGO Inc, ticker number EVGO, which we recently called at $7.67 per share, but it is now sitting at $11.94 per share with a market cap of $3.2 billion. EVGO has been demonstrating a decent bounce back over the last month, being up 27%. And so it is showing some good resilience and upward momentum on the back of this market crash which for me really bodes well for the prospects of this stock over the long term. Following their recent announcement to work with General Motors to expand the EVGO network to 3,250 charging stalls, Subaru selected EVGO as a preferred EV charging partner following the announcement of their first all-electric vehicle. They announced that they had been selected as the preferred EV charging partner of Subaru America following Subaru's unveiling of the first ever zero-emissions vehicle the all-new 2023 Solterra EV SUV at the LA Auto Show in November. And so Subaru drivers will have access to all benefits of EVGO's industry-leading network with its proven reliability, broad geographic reach, and 24-7 customer support. And so with EVGO's networks powered by 100% renewable electricity, Subaru drivers can enjoy a zero-emission driving experience as well as the convenience of charging at more than 800 public fast charging locations and over 1,200 L2 charging stalls spanning 68 metropolitan areas and 35 states. And so EVGO continues to build out its fast charging network and is currently planning to have approximately 16,000 charging stalls deployed by 2027. And it even gets better as EVGO and Toyota announced their new agreement to provide fast charging for their BZ4X customers. And they announced a commercial agreement with Toyota to provide drivers of the new Toyota BZ4X battery electric SUV with complementary charging at EVGO's nationwide network of public fast chargers for one year, which is just fantastic. So EVGO expects to release their financial results on Wednesday 23rd of March, and so a date for your diaries and certainly some exciting times ahead with this one. Next up to our number 3 stock and bang on the list for today for your watch list is Beam Global, ticker number BEEM, which recently called again at $11.59 per share, but it is now sitting at $15.74 per share with a market cap of $157 million. Beam has given us over 30% gain since our last video, but we know with its outlook and with what it has in the tank, it is still in deep, deep value territory as it is still sitting down 44% in the last 6 months. And looking at where it traded in November at $39 per share, if their P&L prospects are anything to go by, then BIM could be explosive from current levels, especially given their latest news. And so after announcing some stellar opportunities with the state of California, on the back of the California blueprint, BIM announced Denso deployed BIM Global Sustainable Electric Vehicle Charging Systems at their Tennessee location to support the company's green focus. And BIM also received a $2.4 million order from Spark Charge for its all-cell battery products. And they announced that they received a $2.4 million order from mobile EV charging company Spark Charge for its BIM all-cell battery storage products, which BIM recently acquired. And they said the acquisition of all-cell was about improving their technology and supply chain, cutting costs, and diversifying revenue opportunities. 
They have made the world's first and only mobile intelligent EV charging network. And so their partnering with Beam All Cell will help them create the next generation of mobile charging as they look forward to powering the future of mobility and clean energy. So some very, very interesting and mind-blown prospects I have for these stocks, but only consider getting in if the price is right for you and if you fully understand the risk. As this video is not financial advice, a buy or sell recommendation, but it's meant to bring some new and exciting EV charging stocks to your attention for you to do your own research. And as always, I would love to hear from you, so please let me know your thoughts on these EV charging stocks in the comment sections below and what other EV charging stocks are catching your eyes lately. And if you're new to my channel, please ensure to subscribe and hit the bell so you're notified when I upload new videos. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, please check out this video right here or this playlist right here to watch equally insightful content from the channel. Thank you so much for being here and I look forward to having you in my next video. Thank you.